love about you? It's your boy. I'm a pro. Can I make my walking dog start Well, well, well. Um, this is not something I was expecting to make. Pretty much, I'm redoing the video that I was planning to go up. I'm gonna say today, though it's a Thursday, it's coming out Friday. I am redoing Friday's video mainly because today I found the time to watch or to catch up on Practical Dave's vlogs and all this. And pretty much he's up to 40 subscribers now. I mean, I can't be happier for him. Honestly, I know he's been putting in a lot of work. Sadly, once school comes up, he probably won't be doing it as much. Bit of a shame, but I mean, what can you do? School, school, you gotta focus on it. I mean, even me, I might just, might lower it down. Let's say to, I mean, this entire week, I've uploaded like 10 videos at this point. So I might lower it down to th two videos over three days. Maybe? I don't know. Um, pretty much, <sighs> I don't know. <laughs> um... I don't know, I don't know what to say, honestly, I'm actually quite speechless. Um, oh, by the way, it's your boy Vortex Chaos here, if you guys couldn't tell already. <laughs> Pretty much, I've... Sorry for those who are getting a little annoyed, because I have mentioned them, this is the third video I'm mentioning him in. Because I mentioned him in Monday's Forza video, and Wednesday's Assetto video. And now I'm recreating Friday's video, because I didn't feel like the one I made for him was good enough. So, I mean, the Assetto video, that's still going up, because I didn't actually do much for that video. But... Besides that, like, this is, this, this is pretty big, honestly, I'll admit. Like, the fact that he's, he claimed that he had 25 subscribers before he started uploading daily, pretty much. Though, I'm pretty sure he did mention that he missed out two days. He's gained 15 subscribers, like, over 11 videos, as he said. I'm just quoting him at this moment. He has gained 15 subscribers, which is quite the growth. Honestly, I don't think even, not even at my peak, I don't think I was even growing that quickly. So, I mean, whether that had something to do with me giving him shoutouts, I don't know. I mean, that probably played a tiny part in it, but for most part, it's probably just his content, honestly, because I, I enjoy it personally. Um, because I think I mentioned it in the video I was planning to post. I do enjoy listening to him. Like, I don't, Sometimes I don't actually look at the video, sometimes I just leave it on whilst I'm doing like a bit of homework or writing some things down or doing like a drawing or painting or something. And I don't know what else to say. I mean, he's made it to 40 subscribers. Sadly, he does have to put a pause on his channel. Um, I have yet to meet up with him in real life to speak about futures and all this kind of stuff. Because I'm pretty sure I mentioned in my Assetto video or my Forza video that I do want to get into vlogging because I find it as an interesting kind of like thing because it's something different for me. Because me, I'm not very used to, you know, showing my face and all this kind of stuff, but I probably will find a way around it. Might just wear a hat and a bandana. I don't know. We'll see. Um, so, currently, I am kind of waiting... For a vlog, I do want to kind of wait until, well, if I get my wheel stand, I might just do a vlog of that and try and, like, build it and all this kind of stuff. I mean, it could be fun, honestly, because I know I'm not the best when it comes to this kind of stuff, but I do try and have fun, though it is quite frustrating. Frustrating. Okay, well, pretty much, I'm just doing A-class races because the Friday video, I was in C-class, but I tried to look for a C-class lobby and couldn't find a proper one. So I just went back to A-class and... Yeah, now I'm, now I'm here. I'm going to do two races and then just get out of here because my little brother was playing and I just interrupted him completely. For those who don't know, I have three little brothers and they enjoy playing Xbox just as much as I do. So I really don't want to take away from their time. It just doesn't seem very fair to them. So I'm going to try and do, I'm not going to try and do this quickly. I'm going to take my time, obviously, but like, you know, they got the whole day. It's fine. <laughs> uh, it's pretty much first race Rio de Janeiro. De Gen Rio de Janeiro. Is that how you say it? Probably not. I don't know. I'm not Brazilian. Uh, I'm so sorry. I'm just gonna wait. And stall it twice. Oh, this is gonna get pretty hectic here. Try and get past him before he becomes out of ghost. Um, right now, 12th out of 14. Let's see what I can do. I still don't have my brake thing on or off. Sorry about that. I mean, I don't use it much anyway. It's kind of just like a rough kind of thing at this point. Anyway, back to the point. 
Practical Day, if you guys don't know already, I have already mentioned him in two of my other videos for those who have been watching and keeping up. Thank you if you have been, honestly, it does mean a lot because this week has, has pretty much had a lot of my time, I guess, because I had to record 10 videos in one day. <laughs> I mean, that was different for me. I actually quite enjoyed it, recording 10 straight videos and then uploading them over the week. I might do the same thing when school comes around, but probably not 10 videos, because that's, that's just a little much, honestly. So I might just lower it down to like six a day or something. I don't know, I'll figure it out. Oh, try and get past this MX-5. He's been causing me trouble this entire race. So yeah, Practical Dave, if you guys don't know already, Go check him out, please. He has been doing much more work than I have. Though, yes, I did record 10 videos. Though it's not really that impressive. Honestly, it might not seem impressive to most of you. That kind of shit, that, that takes a lot of time. Like, I started at 1 and got off at, like, 9. So that's, like, 8 hours of recording non-stop, pretty much. Like, I did have one tiny break. But, like, that's about it. Like, I mean, when school comes around, obviously I'm going to have to focus on it. Because, well, school, school, right? So I can't really do much about that. But, I mean, I'm going to try, try and do my best, hopefully. Because I am quite motivated at the moment i did once again i watched two of his videos the phoenix sun vlog and the his very latest one don't really remember the title off the top of my head but pretty much i mean yeah i just now i'm just waiting for a time when me and him can meet up and actually just plan some shit maybe maybe a vlog or two hopefully i don't know because i i still need to get into vlogging honestly i feel like it's going to probably be more fun than gaming at the moment because pretty sure i did mention this in the video but Sooner or later, I'm gonna get dried up on gaming. Like, oh no, this was in Aceto's video. In video. Whether that was the Wednesday one or the one coming up right after this, like three hours from now. By I mean three hours from now, I mean because this is gonna go up at six and the is probably gonna go up at nine and that's Australian time at least. Not gonna lie, I'm actually still pretty speechless. Um, but yeah, I'll leave his channel link in the description box down below. Please go check him out. I mean, he managed to get from 25 to 40 within like 11 upload days. Once again, I'm going off his, his, his calculations. I mean, he didn't seem too confident when he said it, but I'm just gonna trust that he's roughly correct. So, I mean, yeah, it would be appreciated if you guys did go check him out. Hopefully, we can get him to 50 soon, I guess. Probably by the end of next week, hopefully. I mean, yes, I know he's gonna stop vlogging, but I mean, he needs... You know, just do it anyway. I mean, he's not gonna stop vlogging. Obviously, next holiday that comes by, he's gonna start uploading a lot more again. And then, I don't know, I'm hoping that he uploads at least once a week, maybe. Maybe every Saturday he uploads a vlog or something. Every Saturday or Sunday, depends on him and his schedule. But, yeah, please just go check him out, honestly. I, I am enjoying his videos. I mean, if you guys do like basketball, you could easily just go, you know, have a nice chat with him about your favorite basketball team or something like that. Because me, I'm not... I'm personally not into basketball, it's not really my kind of sport. For those who know me, I'm more of a soccer guy, or football, whatever you want to call it. Like, yeah, I'm not going to say I don't, like, I hate basketball, because I don't. I can't say anything because I don't play it, I don't watch it, I can't really say anything against it, because I don't, you know, I'm not into it. So, oh god. I mean, hopefully those who don't like soccer, you know, they don't talk too much about it, because, well, soccer, at least in my experience, it's a good sport. Like, it's fun, it's... And it, you know, most of the time, there's a good vibe around it if you play with the right people, obviously. Um, another subject that I didn't mention in the Friday video that I probably shouldn't forget about. Actually, I'll mention it in the next race when I will see you guys next. And cut. And I'm back. Though I'm not currently in a race, I just need to explain that in the A-Class lobby, we went to a, what is it, the Nürburgring, if you guys don't know that, it's probably... I think the longest track in the world, like 11 miles, which is like, I don't know how many kilometers, but it's a lot. Um, pretty much half the lobby left, and I was like, you know what, let's just try and look for a C-Class. Didn't find one, so I came to S-Class, and this was the first lobby I got put into. So I'm gonna do the final race as an S-Class, so this should be interesting. Um, as I was saying, while this is loading, I'm gonna mention what I was talking about before, I had to cut and come back. Um, E3, I have yet to make a video on that, or explaining anything to do with it. I... I think I mentioned it in the E... wait, in the Assetto video? I'm not sure. E3, it was interesting. Forza 7 was not announced, we kind of knew it was coming. Uh, Need for Speed Rivals? Not Rivals, Payback, that's what it was. There was another car game, Project Cars 2 I think was announced, though pretty sure we already knew about that, I'm not sure. I'm just gonna slow down, go to the back. Because <laughs> these first couple corners are pretty crazy in any class really. It's like that, I take two positions. I really don't want to go side by side with an alpha. Okay, just got the corner. Wow, like that, four positions already caught. I feel like I'm going to make some more here in a second. 
sand trap. Two guys are hitting each other. I just made some contact, not too much. Okay, let's see what I can do from here now. Look at that, the new Ford GT versus the old one. Let me take the outside on you, boy. Shut the door on him just there. Oh. I mean, I want to try and pick up Forza 7, hopefully, if at the time, or at that moment, I do have the money and the things and all this kind of stuff to get it. I'm hoping, because that game, I I would want to get it. So, and I'm pretty sure they announced over 700 cars, which is pretty much the most in any Forza, like, at all. I think before that game, I think the most was Forza 4, with like over 450 or something. Pretty sure it has more than this game, and more than Horizon 3. Not sure though, but I, I would love to pick that game up. Apparently they announced even more tracks and more of this, more of that. Maple Valley's making a turn for those who love Forza and know that track a lot. It's definitely one of the fan favorites, I'm pretty sure. That and I did hear they might be bringing back Fujimi Kaido, which is more of like a mountain Japan kind of thing. For those who don't know, that's really big, especially, you know, to car guys. Like, we enjoy mountain roads and this kind of stuff. But I'm hoping that comes back. Whether it comes back as a DLC like, a, like Nürburgring did in this game, I went a little wide there. Or they just bring it up base game, that would be pretty cool. But, I mean, I'm, I'm excited for that game, pretty much. And yeah, that's pretty much my take on E3. Not really much did happen. Need for Speed Payback, I might pick that up. If I have the money. But I doubt I will. This is an interesting race. As I said in the beginning of this video, my cousin did make it to 40. Happy for him, really happy for him, well done to him, because I know, as I already said most of this already, he has been putting in the work, he definitely deserves more than just 40, at least that's what I think. Uh, once again, I do hope that he tries to do at least one video a week, or once every two weeks, or just something like that. But I don't want him to completely stop, because that's normally never good. Like, for me, I pretty much took a whole month off, just because I wasn't motivated enough to do anything. I mean, obviously, the first week... I had exams, couldn't really do much about that, so I had to like focus more on that than this. I mean, I managed to pass all my exams, so I'm happy about that, but I mean, yeah. But now I'm back in this, hopefully because I don't really have much till the end of year exams. I'm hoping to continue doing this until that time. God man, it's R34. He does not play around. That was a clean, that was, that was quite clean just then. I mean, it would be appreciated if we tried to get him up to 50, hopefully within the next couple days or the next week or something like that. So I'll leave his link in the description for those who haven't already gone and checked him out and subscribe. I mean, once again, I do want to tr maybe get into vlogging, and he was speaking in one of his videos about possibly a collab. I mean, I'm up for it personally. That I reckon that would be pretty fun, especially if we try and get some more people involved, like cousins and like you know relatives and kind of stuff. God damn, man, why you gotta cut these corners, boy? Race cleanly. Try and check him out, hopefully, if you guys can. And subscribe if you haven't already to him, because... I, I, now I just sound like a broken record. He is putting in a lot of work into this. Once again, probably more than me, honestly. I mean, all I'm doing is just cutting up a video and posting it. Like, it's really not that hard. I mean, anybody can really do this, if I'm honest. You don't even need an Elgato. Like, I know, as he mentioned, like, the PlayStation, it comes with the recording thing on the actual PlayStation. And I'm pretty sure the Xbox has something similar to that as well. I mean, sadly, my computer can't handle 1080p, which is what I hoped it would have been able to handle, but it doesn't. It can only handle 720p, like, video. Which I reckon is good enough. Honestly, it's not the worst, but it's easily not the best. But yeah, you guys really don't need something big to start up any kind of channel or anything. Like, even a vlogging channel, you just need any camera on a phone, on a laptop, on, like, a computer. If the computer has, like, a webcam or something like that. Like, you can use your parents' phone, like, just ask for permission, maybe they'll let you. If you have a sibling, use their phone if they have one. Even relatives, like, just ask for favors. Simple as that. You can just edit a video on your phone, I'm pretty sure there are apps out there to actually do it. You just got to do the research and find it so that you can go out and do it. 
So, I mean, if you guys enjoyed this video, hit the like button. If you guys didn't like it, hit the dislike button and subscribe if you are new. Let me know what you guys didn't enjoy over this week. Like, if there was a certain video that you guys didn't like or something like that. Let me know what it was. Let me know what was wrong with it. I mean, that would be appreciated. I kind of don't want to be just left open. Like, just saying you don't like it. Like, tell me why you didn't like it. Tell me what you liked about it. Tell me what you didn't like about it. Like, you can just mention it in the comments of this video if you want to. Just, like, put the... Either the title or, like, the... You know, just the video. Not, like, a link or something, but, like, you get what I mean. And then let me know under that. It can be... I don't know. Just constructive criticism, pretty much. That's all I'm looking out for. So, I mean, hopefully you guys do enjoy it. I do want to try... Probably the next week. Next week, I'm going to try and do six videos. Two... On Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Hopefully, if things go well. So, I mean, yeah, that's pretty much all for me. Make sure you guys go check out my cousin. He's... Ah, I'm not going to say it again. You guys already know what I'm going to say. Yeah, so go check him out if you haven't already. I'm going to put his link in the description box down below. And yeah, that's pretty much all for me. And peace out. <laughs>